You move over Andretti, Earnhardt, Schumacher. There is a rising star in the sport of racing, and it already looks like he'll end up on that prestigious list. What he lacks in size and age, he makes up for in talent. And as our early show contributor, Ayla Brown, found out, boy, can this kid drive a go-kart. Ayla, good morning. Good yes, to see you. Yes, he can. Santino Ferrucci is just 12 years old, and the prodigy is aiming to become America's next great racing champion. He recently took me out for a spin to see if I could keep up. What you're about to do is um, drive a go-kart going 60 miles an hour. 12-year-old Santino Ferrucci you just steer like a normal car. It's just is like offering a lesson on how to race. Yes. Are you going to come to my rescue if I crash? I guess I'll stop the go-kart and see what I can do. Though he's just four foot six and weighs a mere 60 pounds. <laughs> Santino is considered the best go-kart racer in the country. He's won nearly every title he's gone after since he was seven. What makes you as good, if not better, than everyone you're racing against? Well, it's a lot of hand-eye coordination, and I'm really good with my um, hand-eye coordination. While he doesn't lack in self-confidence, Santino is not all talk. He has such little competition in the States, his driving has now gone global. In Europe, kart racing is as big as baseball back home, and Santino now races here twice a month. How do you stay in school and still race? My teachers are really nice. She just wants me to read, read, read. Like most kids, Santino loves driving go-karts. But for him, it's not just a hobby, it's his career. This is what he wants to do. He loves it so much, and I support him in what he does. Earlier this month, Santino made history in the fast lane, becoming the first American to win a European kart series race in half a century. As for his future goals... Where do you see yourself in five, maybe 10 years? Probably about 10 years. I'm gonna try and be an F1 racer. That's Formula One, as in the world's premier racing series. While he waits to get there, Santino will continue to dominate here on the go-kart track, where I found it simply impossible to keep up with him. So let's talk about this. You kicked my butt. You lapped me four times. With his win in Europe, this is hopefully step one in getting recognition and possible sponsorship as Santino moves forward in his racing career. And you'll love this, Chris. He's still a full five years away from getting his driver's license. <laughs> and four years away from puberty. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't he cute? <laughs> yeah, he's adorable. So what is next for the, uh, the great Santino? The great Santino, he's competing now in Europe, and he's doing phenomenal there, and he'll be going there until school starts, and then he's going to travel back twice a month. And just to put it into perspective, Jeff Gordon and Danica Patrick both competed in this series as yep. kids. Neither of them won, and Santino did. So yeah. he's in a world of his own. And they've turned out OK. They've turned out turned quite out okay. all right. It was probably your height. That was your disadvantage. Yeah, I know. That's why he beat me. There you it's go. too tall. At least you have an excuse. <laughs> Ayla, thanks so much.